Can you hear that sizzle? Yeah, that is the pan-seared lamb that's in the Kirby and Holloway kitchen with Chef Demetrius Shockley. And uh, we are just getting this finished up here. Yes, ma'am. We're going to get ready to plate it. What do we need to do next? So what we're going to do is we're going to obviously turn this off. Turn that <laughs> off, okay. <laughs> and we then, don't... We're, then we're going to plate this at the bottom. So we have a, right here, we have a little bit of um, cauliflower mash. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. And then you're gonna put the... I don't think I've ever been more excited to have Brussels sprouts in my entire life. I always tell the story that when I was young, Brussels sprouts were the things that I hated the most and my mom would try to make me eat. And I would, I would do a standoff. You would just stand there until she and went I, away or you went away? Yeah, uh, I ended up having yeah, So we have this lamb. This lamb is uh, at mid-rare. So and that's okay to eat lamb as medium rare? Yeah. Thank you, Lisa. Yes, definitely is. Thank okay. You. Everything is okay as if you like it that temperature and that style. Uh, whatever is to your liking. A lot of people like their stuff well done, but I find that I like mine medium, medium rare if I'm gonna eat lamb because I feel like it's a lot more flavor in that. Yeah. And so what we have right here is the, the lamb right here for you. Ooh. All right. That looks so, so does this mean we get to eat now? Yes. That, that means, means I, I need to give you a fork here. I take a, a fork? Knife. I have a knife. Oh, you, you have a big knife I have one there. of these things. Yeah, I don't know why they trust me with these things, but. By the way, I love Brussels sprouts now. I yes. don't know what was wrong with me when I was a kid. Yeah, well, the Brussels sprouts, you can infuse a lot more flavor into them now with agave. You got to add honey, uh, all natural um, all natural flavors into it. So. And back then, we used to just boil them until they were mush, Yeah, too. Definitely. That probably had a lot to do with it. Yes. And you were talking about that. You lose a lot of nutrients when you do that, right? Yes, yeah, so uh, I'd, rather have it, I'd rather have it be a, a raw a raw texture. Um, mm -hmm. A lot of things that I'm trying to approach is to just to use the naturalness of the, of, of the vegetables, not having to overcook them or overwork them. Because you know, a lot of kids in school nowadays, they eat stuff that's mush out the can, out of the freezer, so you know you got to add a little bit of flavor to it and everything like that. He's excited about I it. Know. Go, 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 go. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hot dog, that is lamb. Mm. Oh wow, that's not just lamb. That is maybe a little bit lamb. of sauce. Yeah, yeah, go for it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whatever you want, man. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try one of these Brussels sprouts because you say they soak up the flavor. And if you would like the recipe, mm. send us a self-addressed stamped envelope to 1729. North Salisbury Boulevard, Salisbury, Maryland, 21801. Or you can find the recipe on our website, domarvalife.com. Just click on what's happening today. You're getting ready to head back to Florida. Or where, where, where are you going? You to, going? Yeah, I'm trying to go to the Players uh, Championship Tour in about maybe like a week or so. Hopefully yeah. I get the opportunity if they Oppor call me. Okay, all right. Well, Usually I we leave a lot of this for our, 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 the people that run the cameras and everybody behind the scenes. That's not happening today. Mm. I'm <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm glad that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for allowing me to come back and uh, be looking out for Reverse Minds Cafe Culinary Concept. I'm planning on doing some major things in the city with the youth coming up. So. Bring this with you, whatever you go. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. <laughs>